talk about the expectations. This is something you came back from, obviously, to play for a Big 12 championship, play for a national championship. The expectations here this season. They definitely are. Um, and, you know, I, me personally, I, I don't think about them. Um, it it kind of gives something extra to work for, but, you know, the expectations are going to be there. Um, you know, it doesn't matter what we're ranked at the beginning as long as we come out on top at the end. And, you know, that's what, that's what really what we care about and that's what we want. That's not something you figure is like or dislike as far as Not really. I mean, you know, expectations, I mean, like I said, are always going to be there. Um, and you, you don't want to, you know, if they're high, you don't want to let them get to you and don't want to let, let them, you know, kind of bog you down. Just, I mean, just go with it, play hard, and, and do what we can. What has Willie Warren looked like the first few days of practice? He's looked good. He's looked really good. He's brought us a, another offensive weapon, somebody that can score from anywhere on the court, um, which will open up things for all of us. Um, you know, he's a guy that you can't leave alone. And, um, you know, teams won't be able to. I, I really think teams will, will have to pay this year when they double off or, you know, take a man and sag him down in the middle. So, I mean, I think that kind of gives us another weapon. Talk about the strength of the Big 12. I mean, every game can be a tough game. Yeah, I mean, it definitely will. Um, that's something that Coach Cable talks about often. Um, you know, you got to be on your toes every night. Um, you can't you can't take a night off because in the Big 12, you know, that, that could mean a, you know, the difference between a championship and, and you know, not. Early on, what's the biggest difference between this, this season's team and, and last season's team? The depth and athleticism, um, definitely. We have, you know, so many more guys this year that can do so many more things, which will just kind of open us up and, and allow us to run and get out and be more of an up-tempo team. Talk about the opportunity to play with your brother. Obviously, you've been doing that for a while now, but we may be getting towards the point where that may be coming to an end. Just talk about getting to play with I mean, it's going to mean a lot to me, this, this being his senior year, um, being able to play with him. I mean, like you said, it, this could be the last time, and uh, we definitely want to make the most out of it. All the things you hear about NBA being possibly number one, all that stuff, is that a distraction or is that something that is just part of the job? It's something I really don't think about. Um, you know, like, I, like I've said before, if we do well this year and um, we do what we should do, I think all of it will take care of itself. Um, you know, it's really not something I, I you know, think about. It's really not something I worry about at all. We talked about external expectations. What are your expectations for this season? And what what do you have to have for this to be successful? I think if everybody buys in to a, a team concept and what Coach Cable is trying to teach us, um, I think, you know, this year we should contend for, for championships, Big 12 championship, NCAA championship, all that. Um, you know, I really, really want to challenge this team this year to, 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 be, uh, to be on top of our game every single game and not, you know, not let anything slip past us. And the excitement and the atmosphere, Norman, that's something that's been building for a while but seems to be getting to the higher, higher part now. Oh, it definitely is. I mean, it, compared to last year, it's you know it's a lot more exciting. I think people, you know, we, we always hear people coming up and you know saying we can't wait for basketball and all this stuff, and you know it kind of gives us gives us more excitement as a team. Uh, I mean, it just it definitely helps a little, creates a buzz. What about the tournament being in Oklahoma City? Because y'all are obviously the number one preseason. You're expected to to hope to win that. Talk about how much that helps. Looking forward to being in your own city. It definitely helps just kind of having our, our fan base here, um, you know, and being, you know, 30 minutes down the road. Um, it kind of gives us a, a comfort comfort blanket or comfort zone to, to work with, and you know, I think, I think it, it should work to our advantage, hopefully. My final question, Blake, is uh, your game maturing this season? Uh, I've heard that you've added some, a little bit of length to the shots that you take. Tell me about how your game is maturing. I think it. I think it's taking a taking a, a, the next step, um, which is what I wanted to do this summer, and really concentrate on my shot and then work on it and be be more of a comfortable shooter this year. And um, you know, hopefully, I'll be able to show that this year.